What's going on guys, Aldrin Stastio here with flightpath.com. Now if you guys own the Insta360 ONE R and you wanted to add some sort of external audio as well as a light, you're not able to do that on the factory cage right here. There is no mounting options either on the top or here on the side for you to put something like a light or a microphone. Insta360 recently just sent me these adapters right here. This is the accessory shoe mount bracket for the camera itself. So you'll be replacing the original one. And this allows you to have a cold shoe mount here at the very top of the camera, as well as this mic adapter right here. And a quick disclaimer before we get into the video, I wasn't able to do an audio test because for some odd reason, I'm not sure if it was the adapter or something with the software firmware on the camera itself, but I was having some disconnect issues with my microphone. I did let the Insta360 staff know about it. They said they're gonna have their engineers, you know, go through it and take a look at it. So once I'm able to fix that, I will then do another video as far as doing some audio tests with different microphones. So for now, let me just show you this quick video on this new bracket that you're able to use on your Insta360 that does allow you to hold something like a mic as well as a light on top of your camera. And if you guys are new to my channel, my name is Aldrin Astacio. I do a lot of drone tech tips, tutorials, and product reviews right here on this channel. So if that's something that interests you, please consider subscribing and also hitting that bell to be notified when I post new videos. So if you plan on vlogging with the Insta360 ONE R and you want to use something like the 4K camera and that front screen, and you want to add and enhance your audio or your lighting, the standard cage right here does not offer that because you're going to need some sort of cold shoe mount to attach to this cage if you wanted to add some sort of accessory. So that's the reason why Insta360 came out with this new cage right here, which adds a cold shoe mount right at the very top. So here's the top view of the new cage from Insta360. Here's the old one right here and the new one right here with that cold shoe. As you can see, the switch has also moved over just a little bit. That way you're able to then access the latch here. So all you have to do to open it up is press this in and then pop this up and over and then you're able to then put in your camera. I think it would have been nice too if they added another one right here just because it's an open area. And if you wanted to add something like a mic and a light, that would have been a good option. Unfortunately, they only have one here at the very top. So if you wanted to enhance your audio, like I said, I'm gonna do another audio test later. For some odd reason, I was having a little bit of an issue with it, and I'll actually show it to you in a second. And I use the mic adapter. All you have to do on the side is open up that door. And then you have this USB-C adapter that does attach to a 3.5. So you have to plug that in just like that. Here's what I was mentioning earlier, but I was having a little bit of issues. As you can see on my screen, there is no microphone icon at the moment, but if I press this in, you can see that icon then pop up. But for some odd reason, I would have that icon always turn on and off when I would have the microphone in there. So it wouldn't always turn on. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. As you can see here, I just plugged it back in and it's not on. So once I get that figured out with Insta360, I'll make sure I do a full audio test. But for now, I just wanna show you guys the option that you can use with the cage and a microphone. Now, if you don't wanna enhance your video with a microphone, you can also use a light. Right now, I'm just using this Loom Cube light here, and this one has a attachment on the front that diffuses the light just a little bit so it's not so harsh. There you go, you're able to then add the light to the front of your camera. And if you wanna, of course, boost that light up a little bit more, you're able to do so just like so. So if you like to vlog and you're in some sort of area that has a little bit of low light, you're not able to boost up that light in front. That's one of the things you wanna do to enhance your videos by adding in a little bit of light to your subject. And there it is guys, just a quick video to show you guys the new accessory shoe mount bracket for the Insta360 ONE R. Something you're gonna need if you want to attach something like an external microphone or a light to your setup. And like I mentioned earlier, I will be back with an audio test once I figure out what happened or what's wrong with the connection with this mic adapter to my camera. I was having a little bit of that disconnect issues. So once I figure that out, I will make sure I do a full audio test using different audio setups like this microphone, as well as I have other things like the Rode Wireless Go and a couple other ones that I'll be testing out. So stay tuned for that. If you guys got some value from this video, of course, don't forget to hit that like button. And also don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when I post the new videos. This is Ultra Nostasio with flightpath.com. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.